Colburn Bible, Book 6, Book of Morals and Precepts, Chapter 14, The Mean Man. Wisdom respects free will. Man's law is situational, violates God's gift. Judging others is only what God can do. NPR 1410. The mean man and the braggart may seem incompatible, but man is a many-sided creature. The mean and miserly heart and the most boastful tongue so often share the same body. The busiest tongue has the least cause to wag. What does it seek to cover up? Human behavior is complex, takes on many forms. Only you can pick up clues from past people, but that does not mean the new person is going to be exactly like the last one you had. Having been hurt so often, be wary of judging too fast. You might find you tossed away the person of most value in life, the one with the ability to learn from mistakes. Still, I will point out, listen to the person. Do they talk of the past and insist that everything was done to them? It's a good sign if they are unable to admit their faults, no matter if they have a point that the wrong done to them was greater. They are likely not capable of learning from mistakes. You must have the ability to understand it takes two to have a conflict or misunderstanding. You are not attempting to change them, only to decide if this person is worth your time. Just how much of an investment should you make on someone incapable of seeing how they affect others? Only you can decide if looks and money is enough to overlook the flaws in character. The last part, the busiest tongue has the least cause to wag, and it ends with the word cover-up. Fact is, you do not need to fear exposure if you are true to yourself. The shame is within you. If what you do is wrong, if you know others will not like what you do, and you do it anyway, that is a flaw in your character. You will have no need for secrets if you understand what you do could affect others and refuse to go further.